No, I saw just what I needed to see. Uh, backed up, had a good bounce in his step, uh, very happy. Uh, you know, we just took it easy with him out there. Went about a mile and three eighths. Bob just said, you know, just give him a nice, easy first day back out, which we did. You know, you, you, we want him to eat constantly. You want, you know, this horse carries his weight very well, and he's just made it very easy for me. The horse does run in the mud well, but you ought to see him on a dry track. <laughs> you know, you guys haven't seen him on a dry track, and you know, I'm waiting to see him on a dry track myself. You know, it's uh, just take one day at a time, you know, try not to think about it too much. I just think about the next day of training right now. Um, you know, I won't even think about Triple Crown until once we actually do get to Belmont. Uh, my job is just to keep him healthy, sound, and uh, get him up there fresh and happy. You know, you know, he has a big heart, good set of lungs. You know, characteristics-wise, it's hard to compare the two because they were both, uh, American Fair was so docile. And this horse is a, a little more pushy. Uh, you know, he's, he lets you know he's around. American Pharaoh was just so easy to handle. Uh, but it, that's in the barn. Now on the racetrack, he's, he's very kind on the track and pretty much does whatever you want him to do.